Susan Lajuda here with Beckett. We have here a Basketball Box Busters 2012-13 Fleer Retro. This is from Upper Deck. They have the Fleer name now. And in this you get two inner boxes. In each inner box you get ten packs. And there are five cards in each pack. You'll get six autographs in every box. With a chance to get some pretty cool names. Talking Michael Jordan, LeBron James. Fellas like that. Of course, they're on their either high school or college uniform, depending on the players, such as LeBron. And uh, what you, one of the cool things you also get in here is uh, the retro inserts, where you get like precious metal gems or Z Force Rave, Flair Legacy, things like that. So, four classic inserts in every box. Some of them are actually pretty tough to get through. So here we go. Right. First mini box. This is where you get you one of these mini boxes inside, and inside you'll get ten packs. Alright, first pack. Reggie Miller, these are the base card design. Julius Irving. They have a Reggie Miller Ultra card. Dennis Rodman. And Dominique Wilkins. It's pack one. Pack number two. Isaiah Thomas. Spencer Haywood, I saw an autograph, but I didn't see who it was. Danny Manning, fresh in autograph. That's what the back of the card looks like. Congratulating me on this autograph. Alan Houston. On the back of the cards, on the base cards, you get the college stats and then a little bio blurb. And Carl Malone. Pack three. Tony Kukoc. That's uh, the Yugoslavian flag, but now defunct Yugoslavia, where my parents came from. David Thompson. Here we have a Fleer Rookie Sensations. Mo Harkless. These cards even feel different. They actually don't have a foil, like not foil, they don't have a gloss on the back, they're actually just plain cardboard. Mark Price and Larry Johnson. Next. Danny Manning, base. Alonzo Morning. We have an insert here. Flare Showcase, Nick Van Exel, Legacy Collection, Row Zero. If you remember on the back, they had Seat Row. So, Section One to Row Zero. You have a Jordan Base, and Ray Allen. Harold Miner and Tim Hardaway. Tim Hardaway's son is getting drafted tonight. Speaking of Hardaways, Anthony Hardaway, Ultra. Bill Walton and Jamal Mashburn. Ah, Spud Webb. Fan favorite. We have a rookie sensation, John Shurnham. Autograph, I didn't even see who it was yet. Fresh ink autograph, Draymond Green. Ultra. Same kind of back to it. We have here uh, Cheryl Miller, sister of Reggie Miller. 
she uh, she was included this year. You might have seen the post on the blog. She was included this year. Sort of like test the waters of maybe having you know a couple different people included into basketball products. There's also um, a Tony Gwynn card. Tony Gwynn of the Baseball Hall of Fame. Christian Leitner. Mark Jackson. We have a uh, EX card, Fleer EX, Reggie Miller. It's not numbered. Not numbered. David Robinson, Gary Payton. Allen Iverson. Magic Johnson. Mo Harkless, Lucky 13. Some St. John's fans are going to be happy with that. Jason Kidd, he's so young here. And Sean Elliott. Bill Russell. John Havlicek. We got a Z Force card of. David Thompson. And we have Glenn Rice and Grant Hill. Alright. Last pack in the first inner box, because we still have the whole entire inner box to get through. Vinny Del Negro, and I believe there's going to be an autograph in here because we only had two of our autographs so far. Paul Pierce. Miles Plumley, Rookie Sensations, and here it is. J. Crowder, Fleer Focus Autograph. Last two, last card, David Cowens. So that was one mini box. We got a whole other mini box to get through. Here we go. Started from top to bottom before, so I'm going to try to go that way again. Julius Irving, Isaiah Thomas, Lou Hudson, Ultra, Alan Houston, Carmelo. We've already seen those cards. Spencer Haywood, Tony Kukoc, Rookie Sensations, Darius Miller. I got a Dear Collector card. Dear Collector. Let's see who we got. We have a 2012 Fleer Retro Basketball, 91-92 Fleer Rookie Sensations Auto. No numbering of Jeremy Lamb. So, Dear Collector, your card is not ready. David Thompson, Danny Manning. I have an EX card of uh, Larry Johnson. Also a base of Larry Johnson. And an extra base card of Michael Jordan. The one and only. Magic Johnson, Bill Russell. I see an autograph. This one is ready for us. Mark West on a Fleer Mystique design. Old D. On Rice and Grant Hill again. So we got our first two autographs pretty quickly. There's a whole order, another autograph expected for us here. Base, base, base. Rookie sensation, Andrew Nicholson. With the Bonnies. We have a Flair Legacy Showcase of John Havlicek. This one's actually row number one, numbered out of 150. So that one. Got a numbered parallel. Paul Pierce, Reggie Miller, Z Force, Dennis Rodman. He's looking all crazy. Crazy face, Dennis Rodman. Dennis Rodman base. See a little trend going on here. And Dominique Wilkins. Short shorts. This came out last year. It's a pretty popular product for. Oh, it's a pretty popular product last year for 
upper deck. I said, oh, because I actually didn't get anything in this deck. Walt Frazier, AC Green, Gary Payton. Here we have a LeBron base card with the Fighting Irish. And Hakeem Olajuwon. Bernard King, Little Penny Hardaway, Jeff Hornacek on a Fleer Metal Universe design, number two, 100, Michael Ray Richardson, Nate Thurmond. Alright, two packs to go. Clyde Drexler. Rookie Sensations, Darius Johnson Odom. Rookie Sensation, I mean, I might as well have gotten an autograph of this guy considering I've pulled a bunch of his cards, I feel like. Mo Harkless. So we have an auto of that Rookie Sensation from Jim Jackson and Jeff Point. Last pack from Clear Retro Hoops. Larry Bird Bass, Alan Iverson Bass, Gary Payton Ultra, Jason Kidd Bass, and final card, Sean Elliott. So there you have it. That You get a bunch of base cards, if I could pick them up without dropping them. Here's a stack of cards that you get out of it, along with six autograph cards. Some are, some are pretty good autographs, some... A little shaky there, but you get a lot of cards, however, with the chance to get some pretty cool hits. If you hit one of the low-numbered inserts, they could actually go for a pretty decent amount of money on the secondary market. But there you have it, folks. Let me know what you think down in the comments of 2012-13 Fleer Retro Basketball. Thanks.